Hi, um, you really have to speak French here and understand it in order to get around. I got on a bus this morning to see a specialist doctor and the driver didn't say anything to me. They usually do, but he didn't say anything. And he totally skipped the center of town. Um, apparently none of the buses are going through the center of town heading south this morning. He didn't tell me anything, so I paid a ticket and the bus just came straight down here to Port de Paris. Uh, I was able to ask the driver, you know, they don't speak English here, uh, if I could get another bus back in the opposite direction to get to the center of town where I need to be, and he said, yeah. And um, I said, well, can I use the same ticket, but on a different bus line to get back to what you skipped, and he said, yeah. So I didn't rag on him, but I think I made it clear that he really should have told me when I was getting on the bus that he, he wasn't taking the normal route. So even though um, public transportation is pretty good here in Paris and around Paris, and if you buy a 10-pack of tickets, which is called a carnet, you get a substantial discount. Uh, it still does take a long time to get from point A to point B on public transportation, and um, you really have to speak French and understand it. Uh, otherwise, well, I've had people visit and they really got lost. I had some American ladies visit from Rhode Island a few years ago and they insisted that they would be okay and they were not. They couldn't remember anything that I had told them. I told them they had to sit down for lunch between about noon and one o'clock or they wouldn't get lunch and they didn't listen to me and they got on a bus and they ended up in Anguien les bains They really didn't know where they were. And um, they complained and said that the French were misdirecting them. <coughs> and that they kept saying, à droite, à droite, you know, to the right, to the right. And I said to them, well, were they saying à droite or tout droite? Because tout droite means straight ahead. See, they were only hearing the droite. <coughs> and they thought they was that that was the opposite of gauche, which is left. And then their faces fell. You know, um, I, I'm telling you, you it's a very good idea to hire a private guide for when you visit anywhere in France, but especially Paris. Uh, just you know, they really don't speak English here. The Parisians are not known for being extremely warm and open and helpful. And you might say, well, screw them, but there's something called French d discretion, and it's cultural. You know, if, if you ask a French person, where's City Hall, you know, they'll say, well, you take a right here and go two blocks, and then you take a left and go three blocks, and there's City Hall. They won't tell you what City Hall's closed or that there are major roadworks going on and you can't go that way at all because you didn't ask, you know? And in Italy, they won't even want to admit, oh, shit, I should have gotten off at that stop. I'm busy yakking at you. Um, they won't even admit that they don't know uh, the answer, so they'll just tell you anything. <laughs> It's kind of messed up. Well, I've missed my bus stop. I could take a bus in yet the other direction, which would make three bus rides, but I'll just probably walk because I'm very early. All right, see you later. Bye.